Hi friends, welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new here. If you're new here, I do plus size fashion videos every Wednesday, so hit that subscribe button and hit the bell button, all that stuff. So thank you so much for being here. So today, we're gonna do something I haven't done in a while, which is shop in store. So today we have a Torrid haul and this is from the Torrid Hot Cash Sale. I had three hot caches to use and that's $75, so I could go up to $150 and get $75 off so essentially a half off if you do it right. So I'm an accountant. I was doing the math in my head in the store. I was there for like an hour doing the math. And I was like, okay, I got it to exactly where I want it to be. Because I also had a 10% off thing. Because if you do that little survey in the store, they give you something, the 10%. And I had a $10 reward. So I, um, like Alan in the hangover, the math, it was happening. And I got it to where I needed it to be. And then somehow I got an even bigger discount. So I don't know what happened. Maybe the sales girl gave me the 30% off as well. But I got like $175 worth of merchandise for $60. So I'm going to show you what I got. Also, this is like my millionth tour at haul in the past like two months. But I'm basic. Like it happens. I just really like their stuff. Okay, so the first thing is a top I'm going to use for work. I saw this online and I just thought it was so pretty. It's a purple and black floral top. Really, really great piece for work. It is see-through, so obviously you got to wear a cami inside. But I just thought this was really cute. Um, this I got in a 2X. They didn't have any ones. And then I overheard the sales girl telling the someone that the one on the mannequin was a one, but it was one of those mannequins way up high. I'm like, I don't want to hassle this girl. I tried it on. It is a little big, but again, I didn't want to hassle them to get it off the mannequin. So I was like, I'm cool with the two. A one would be better, but I'm fine with the two. This is a little big, but give it one round of my dad doing my laundry and it should fit like a glove. But again, you know, more of a modest top. It has, it goes up further in the front. I know I'm booby all the time, but sometimes you gotta be a little bit more modest. So this is a great top for work. You can also just like plop some jeans on it. I said plop and pop at the same time. I don't know. Put some jeans on with it and it's a cute, casual, kind of look too. And I just really love the purple and the black. I'm basic. Speaking of basic, I got a taupe colored sweater. Um, there was other things I kind of wanted, but it wasn't working out mathematically in my head. So I went with this because I tried it on and I was like, this is really comfy. So it is a basic, but it's comfy and it's going to be a good like layering piece. So it's just like a taupe plain sweater, little open neck, nothing tight or constricting. I really like this, guys. It is so soft. I wish you can reach through and grab it and touch it. This one is also in a size two. My Torrid literally never has any sizes, but I'm really loyal to that location, but they literally never have any ones. But who doesn't like a nice oversized cozy sweater? And again, I think this would be good for work, good with jeans, put a nice little necklace with it, put a jacket with it. Um, so it's kind of plain, but I really liked it. I also got some work pants. I really love their, like, it's like the Noir collection. Whatever it is, it's that, like, nice black pant line that they have. I do the Millennium All Nighters. Those are my favorite pant of all time. Really thick waistband. I get the size one in the tall. Forever, I was getting the regular length, and I was like, why do I look like Urkel? So then I got the tall, and they were the perfect length, and, um, I'm five foot eight for reference. So I wanted to try their straight leg pant. The other ones fit more like a legging. So I was like, let me try the straight leg pant um, just for like work purposes. So I picked these up and these are never on like torrid sale. Like they're never in clearance, which I shop clearance a lot. So I was like, if I'm gonna use hot cash, I'm gonna use it on that pant line because they're really good quality and they're never in clearance. So it's best to use your hot cash on something like this. So I got the straight leg pant. These are more of a, these are, yeah, the Noir Pant Collection straight leg. This one is more of a trouser material. The other ones are a ponty pant, which is basically a thick legging. This one is, it's definitely a different kind of fabric, but it is stretchy, um, a little bit more structured. And this one, like I said, is a straight leg. They do have a boot cut. I'm like, that's a little too much of a flare for me. Um, but I did want something just like a little bit more open, um, just something different. Um, I don't know how I feel about these. These fit amazing in the waist um, and they have the, this kind of button. They slide into these, um, that kind of button and a zip. 
amazing in the waist. I don't feel like I'm spilling over. Um, it's flattering. You're not bulging anywhere because they are thick. So I really like that. For me, and the length is great. The tall length is great for me. Um, around the knee, it starts getting a little big. Like there's a, it's really baggy in my knees. But then, um, you know, along my calf, and then um, along my calf is fine. And then it is a straight leg, so I wasn't expecting, you know, a legging fit. But I feel like it flared out just a little too much. I was expecting something like hugging the ankle and then just a little bit more. Whereas it's kind of just like hugging the ankle, not even hugging the ankle. So I don't know how I feel about these. Um, I don't know. So these might go back or just exchange for the regular noir collection pant that I already have and I like and I like stocking up on those for work. So it was like a good effort that I tried a different kind of style in that pant family that I like, but I don't know how I like the fit from the knee down. So it was a good effort, but these might be exchanged. All right, and then this one is one of those things I was looking at and I was doing the math and I was like, okay, if they take the 10% first, it's gonna work out this way. And if they take the 10% last, it's gonna work out this way. I did literally every possible combination of math in my head. Um, and then when I saw that whatever was happening on that discount screen was giving me more room to buy stuff, um, it was still under 150. So she's like, in order to use your $75 of hot cash, go grab something so we can get it up to 150. So I went and grabbed this and it's something I've been wanting for a while. I've been seeing these everywhere. So it is a belt bag, so it's a essentially a fanny pack but we're gonna be classy and say belt bag um so it's a belt it's a bag it's a bag on a belt and what i like about this one is that you can detach this bag and just use the belt if you need it um so these are really functional because i do a cross body bag right now i used to do wristlets but sometimes you truly want to be like hands free and not have the bulge of the bag or the bag cutting you off weird. So it's functional, especially if you want to create a waist. Um, and then you can put your phone in here. And this one does fit a full, where is it? iPhone 7 Plus. It's big enough and there's room for your wallet too. So I was like, I was kind of eyeing this online. I was like, well, what if my phone doesn't fit? So it fits the phone. It's a cute little quilted, um, pattern and it has a top zip which I like you know and your bags on you so you're gonna know where your stuff is at all times which I really like I really appreciate it um, I am traveling more in the future so I feel like this is a really good um, way to have everything that I need on me and I know where it is um, and you know it fits the essentials so I really like these and it's cute I really like this these are everywhere so I've been really wanting to try these um, and it fit in the math of that hot cash thing so great little addition to this haul. And then still somehow I still wasn't at, you know, 150 or whatever after all the discounts. So they have those little things you can grab by the register. So I just grabbed a 24 karat gold mask. Um, I like doing masks. This was $5 pre sales and then came down to like the three that I needed um, post sale. So this is an easy little thing to grab. I remember back in the day trying to get your hot cash right and Torrid had literally nothing under $19. So it used to be hard, you know, five years ago. Now they have more grabbable things. Another thing that I also grab a lot is those Torrid little roller perfumes. Those are like six-ish dollars. So if you're ever in like a bind at Torrid and you need a small amount just to get to like the sale thing, grab a rollerball, grab a face mask. They do now have those kind of smaller items so you don't have to pick up like a necklace or $19 socks just to get your discount. So that was my small little hot cash haul. Again, I wanna say the whole total was like 175 and I paid $60, so that was awesome. So I know I'm kind of basic and kind of boring, but I did wanna show you what I got and you know, they're good workwear pieces, good loungewear, not loungewear, but like, cozy hanging out wear so um i really like them and i'm so happy about the deals i got i love deals we know that here so thank you guys so much for watching and again if you are new here i do plus size fashion videos every wednesday so hit that subscribe button and i will see you guys next week bye okay i just want to show you my total saved is 110 dollars that's crazy